How long you and Peter Tash was together? Nine years. You and Peter Tash were together nine years. Only the nine league, years. Only the league, legally so married. Peter from Yago School, you know. You yeah, know Peter from Yago School? Yeah, man. Man, a little young school girl, you know. They were a big man. <laughs> Enough time I have to hide out of my mother's house for the meeting, you know. So, t- <laughs> so only the league legally married? In, in Nigeria. Only married in Nigeria. Only have African Yes. Rest. And you know who took us to Nigeria too? Michael Alatunje from Nigeria. That man that did this album named Jumps of Passion. Olatunje, Baba Tunde, Olatunje. Baba Tunje. He Ola was Tunje. the one you did meet that him. brought me and Peter down in Nigeria. Okay. And set, set up the whole marriage ceremony and everything mm. for us, you know. All right. I remember to find what you're talking about. I joking. know so Peter is a man. The man is not believe in a Babylon wedding. Yeah, yeah. Going to church in front of a pastor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The man is yeah. in a them room. All right. But so if we are me, married, it has to be a native thing, you know? Yeah, all right. I remember to hear the journey with you and Peter. You say you talked to him from school days. Mm-hmm. And you used to hide and, and, and sneak out with him and all these things. But eventually, you start to really angling business and all them something they too. You used to yes. go with him and things. Right? Yes. And you used to live with him? Yes. You didn't live... Which, uh, which part of the first place you had him live? All right. Me and him live first. You saw the mother and father get to know him? Them start love him. Your mother and or your father? Huh? Your mother or your father? Yes. Yeah. I met them meet him after a time mm-hmm. and them get to love him. Okay. So now them start to accept him now to come to the home. Mm-hmm. So Peter practically live on my house at East Kingston, mm-hmm. right at the foot of Warwick Hill. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right? We live there in my mother's house for about four years. Because what I mean, live there, you know, and I like to say, a movie, you yeah, know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But, but it's a man who come on my house from the... Yeah, yeah. And he not left there till five o'clock the next morning. Yeah, so yeah. I have to say, he lived there. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. For real. Yeah. yeah, man, so it started there at my mother's house. And then we bought this house at Plymouth Avenue. Peter bought this house for me when I'm 21. He always said, Marlene, you know, someone want to take you out of the ghetto. I'm going to buy your house, man. Mm-hmm. And take you away from us. It's too nice to live a ghetto, man. You know? Yeah. And I said, my this ghetto is still Yeah, but him no one. Yeah, you know? Yeah, but I said, no, up, man. That's take away from, yes, sir. Yeah. I'm saying, for real? I'm saying, yes, man. Them tell them, I don't really believe you, but uh, but I say, yeah, yeah. And I tell you, oh, the man really buy me a house mm-hmm. and take me away from the ghetto still, you know. Yeah. Even all of them, they have a next house still, uh, radio, you know. Mm-hmm. But the house, you know, him have a baby man that will live there mm-hmm. with some, some of his kids, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. we never violate that. Yeah, yeah. But make sure and the children them go and live there. Yeah. And then buy this other house now where me and him start living now. Yeah. Me, me, me live with the man when I'm about, like, say, I'm reach. 20, 21, exactly, 21. When you and him started living together. together, 21? Yes. Yeah. And how much year old he was at that time? Peter? Yeah. Peter is 17 years my senior. Okay. So, so, all right. Uh-huh. Yeah, so he was about 38. Right, yes. Right. Okay, okay. All right, so they live at Plymouth now? Mm-hmm. All right, so which which one I'm sang them now was the song where like did a move at the time when you and him started to live together oh uh, well we started living together uh, oh i think the album was uh, mama africa mama africa yes mama africa all right because i remember spending countless nights in studio with peter with that album yes yes i know the bridge you know the jacket as well him, 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 him oh, africa, you know. okay ma- yes yeah, I know him. All right. So only live at Plymouth and so all all the relationship go now between the other ladies them where you know the other ladies them them know say you animal live up there. So but you was not the first one. No. So all, all that relationship actually, go now. Uh, actually all of Peter Baby's mother was really before me still in her. All of them. Right? All of them. <laughs> you serious? Mm-hmm. You were the yeah, last one. You were the last one. Lead. You were the last right. one to talk to. Yeah, I'm the last one. <laughs> so you never have yeah, no youth film. You never have no youth film. Still, you know. Yeah, you never have no youth film. No, no. Yeah. But I've had a four miscarriage. Yeah, four for miscarriage. Peter. Yeah, yeah. Resulting in five youths. Okay. The first one was twins, and then three 
other miscarriage, you know? All right, so... I mean, life was really rough, really rough. Where is it rough, what do you mean? Really rough. It, it, you know, it, it, it was a lot to handle. Peter, plus seven, nine youths, living with me at one stage. Oh, them used to live with me, too? Yes, at one stage, I took seven of Peter kids in my home. Mm. Yes, because when them baby mother run out, two of Peter youth them out mm. of Peter house in various. Them come to my house and Peter on tour. This is the first time I'm meeting two big sons them, because I didn't know them. Mm. And them reach the house, say, Marlene, you know that um, Peter baby mother run we out of the house, or we don't have anywhere to live. Mm. I say, yes. Mm. So I said, all right, um, I kept them in. I said, I'm going to call on the father, so then tell him, take him place. Right, and I yeah. called Peter, I said, you know, say, two big sons are here. And I said, your baby mother run them out of the house. So Peter said, yes. So I said, yeah, man. He said, all right, Molly, let them stay till, till when I come from off a tour, I'm going to start out the thing. I said, yeah, man. When Peter come now, and I tell Peter everything that was happening to you. Mm. Peter go up to him house and take him out of two of you that she have. Bring them, come give me. Mm. That makes four now. Until I have to leave him house, right? Mm. Uh, then I said to myself, no, four of them live there. So I asked them, where are Peter other kids? So them tell me, said, Peter has two daughters in Spanish Town. So I sent for the two daughters them, and my next daughter in Duane Park. I said, I sent for Chito. So I sent for three other kids, and I have no seven, seven of them in my room. house. Yeah. Four live permanent with me, and three come on weekends. So on weekends, it's seven you me have to look after, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. Plus Peter make eight. That time Plus was, that time, how old he was at that time? Then, then, 21, 22. Eh? Young little girl. Yeah. For me, should have out there enjoy myself. I'm lock up in a house yeah. <laughs> with seven you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I devote my life to these kids. I tell you the truth, yeah. yeah, yeah. I try to be a mother. I try to be a friend to them. I try to do everything, you know? So you I'm telling them young, I never have no experience. And you want them to get on, though? You want them to get on? Peter? You want, no, you yeah. want the youth them to get and on. And it's them, yes, man. It's when them first come, Lord. I love them as a shame, and them love me back, too. Yeah. Yeah, man, we, we had a real good relationship. Yeah, all right. When them first come. But just after, no, when I one and two of them feel, so yeah, she a young girl, Peter, having her house, not much older than we, some of we. It's yeah. like, you know, this disrespect start rolling, you know. Okay. I don't see some young, them are same age, and, you know. Yeah, And yeah. can't do as them like, you know, the house. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? Yeah. I mean, I said, no, man. Not because when I see some young, one, it's like, you know, the same age group. I'm just a little couple years older than someone, you know, and I feel say, when I come do as in a life with me. Yeah. You know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah. me would tell Peter what's going on when I'm not there on tour. Because when, when I'm not there, you know, me, I have to be mother and father, to these kids, you know, mm. right? So, Which wasn't an easy job. So you never used really? to go on tour with him? You never used to go on tour with him? Yes, I used to, yes, yes. Mm. I started touring with Peter before we bought the house um, in Plymouth Avenue. Yeah. Then I stopped touring now because the kids them now come and I have to stay home with the children them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. I mean, stopped touring now just to stay home with Peter's children. Yeah. All right. Yeah. So, 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 what I'm to the house then now? Because All right. I'm not going to lie to you, I'm going to some money to a bank on the house. Yeah. And I tell you, say, Muta, I just couldn't pay the money. Everything just That's shut down That's for me. That's before or after you know? I'm dead? That's before or after I'm dead? After I'm dead. After, after I'm dead, dead. Muta. Oh, so after I'm dead, you're still living at the house? Yes, ma'am. Still living at the house a while. Yeah. Till, um, till the bank forced me out of it. Yeah. Said they're repossessed. Said they're wanting to come and pay back the loan and mm. whatever. I'm trying to save the house, Muta. Me even got do the me even do a documentary with um Wayne Jobstone. Yeah. Hoping that more than Red X. create some funds Red, from it. Red X. Red X. Yeah. Me say me work with them in the motor. Me give them the whole access. I'm a place, mm. flames, tape, everything I could have find yeah. to really get this documentary you still going. Lose it. You still I tell Wayne Jobs about the, the problem I'm having with the house. Yeah. And we need to get some money. And you know, so even up till today, when jobs don't look for me and give me a dollar, mm. them don't even return my tapes, them. Yeah. Not even respect me enough to return my tapes. Oh. That's what when jobs so did. So, him still have the tape, them? Yeah. And so, him still have the tape, them? When jobs still have, yes. And, you know, some very important tapes. Some right. tapes with um, Peter doing shows all over the world. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. All right. Make a, make a, if you jump forward, I'll 
talk about come again come to Ali yeah, no yeah, I'm yeah, saying I could jump forward and talk about that day when this terrible thing go on in the house tell me explain your version of the whole thing I go on in the house there. um the killing yeah 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 my mother call it that because there's no other way we can yeah man it's it. a killing man tell me tell, tell it's a killing man yeah so like from you want to hear from like beginning yeah man yeah man we have time man we have time we have time we have time <laughs> yeah. 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 Was one of the happiest day with me and Peter. I mean, I know all the time happy, so we happy, we happy, we laugh. We say everything was just perfect. Mm. That's tell you. So we did a laugh and enjoy ourselves. And me and him are kitchen, no one. Peter said, my name, you want to cook tonight, you know. I mean, I said, no, Peter, man, you have to cook, man, because Peter him loving me for coming out in line. He's a great chef. Mm. We talk about cooking, that is my name. Yeah. And Peter can cook good, you know. Yeah. So we did a laugh. He must say, you cook, Marley. And I said, no, Peter, you cook. So anyway, we, we did a laugh till we end up that the both of us cook the meal together. We start the food and Peter finish it. Yeah. So I said, the real laugh. And then um, Santa was there. Santa come over. Got brown come over. Because them people that love my food. Yeah. So them used to come over and have dinner with us. Yeah. So that brown come to have dinner with us and... Free mm -hmm. and his wife you not know, coming you now to have you know, mm -hmm. with, that, with that, you know? But, but them coming, them wasn't there, you know, mm -hmm. at the time. Free and joy, you know, them coming, you know, the make like everything. Yeah. So when we did it, you know, and that boy you now bring his big bottle of something and lift come, you know, because I always bring a juice and so. Yeah. So we finish eating, you now we did it, you now I said, I'll go drink up the front and lift and we we'll drink up the front and lift and you no know, one. See the size and real, this was real happy. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. Mr. Motor, the moon expect nothing like that mm. at that day. Trust mm -hmm. me, man, we were happy. Anyway, I'm there now. We just hear like the gate knock. I'm going to say, Lord, um, Fry and his wife come now because I expect Fry and Joy now, you know. So, I look for Michael. I thought one of Peter's friends that was at the house. Mm. I'm going to say, Michael, go and let him Fry and Joy for me now. But the dogs, them down there going wicked, you know, because I love animal, you know. Mm. Really. So, never let the dogs in the yard and birds and all of that. But I noticed my dogs are go extra wicked. So, I said, oh, the dogs are going so. No, man, this is funny. So, anyway, I look through my glass door from upstairs. Fry. Fry. Mm. It's a bite time to sit on there. And I said, wait, so I'll make it take so long to come up with joy and fry. So, dogs, them still get wicked. So you you you, you, yeah, just, we, eh? you you see Joy and Fry through the glass door? No, Joy and Fry. It wasn't Joy and Fry. Oh, you know, oh, they the never them. Okay. Oh, but you never but see them. But when you look through the glass door, no, them, they're behind the wall. I mean, never see them. Okay. You just see Mike at the gate with the dogs, them. Yeah, how much of them it was? How much of them it was? Three gunmen. Three of them, all right, yeah. So, after... Huh? Uh, when I reach now. <laughs> no, you say you, you sit down back. No, you sit down back. You say you sit down back. <laughs> no, you didn't wonder why uh, Michael never come up. Right, and I said, so, how Michael takes so long to come up, man, and the dogs are not going to so. But I still like, check it for granted, say, so, probably to the dogs, they don't really know if I enjoy it so good, you know? Yeah. So I said, I still sit down. I said, Mota, when I look, I just see Mikey. Come up, stay on a stay up on me with him, your eyes, them wide open, look strange. I mm. mean, I see nobody else, you know, just Mikey, you know, mm. just see, I come towards me, you know. Let me say, oh, Michael looks so, I can frighten. Mm. It's about time, um, you say to Michael, Michael, oh, you look so, I never leave. A while ago, look so. When me look, me just see three gone man behind Michael with three gone. Mm. I see the leper first. Mm. But a leper is caught in in and out, you know. Mm -hmm. But with no leper, leper was any stranger. So he take the old road to bring them in. And not all oh, sit wait. Them always come to come look at from us. And we, we give them what we can give them. Mm -hmm. If we want food, we cook, we make them eat. So yeah. uh, some speak. Is that bridging that used to check me to? Nobody food, everybody eat. Is that bridging that used to check me to, you know? Huh? He used to come to my shop, you know, leper. He used to come to my all shop, right. too. yeah. Come look at don't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm mean, sure you didn't do just like anybody ah, no, else, yeah, you know? I'll to me and all them something there too. All right. Yeah. So I saw him introduce himself to me now. Same with a dub port and must have come from prison and want help and all of yeah, that. Yeah, so we never know him. My people yeah. didn't know this man. All them must have the woman say, the man go to prison, Peter. Not like that. Come and check all them things that, you know, the courts record in the car. 
Me no let anything on you know. I'm a tell people, check them something they say, the boy they go to prison for Peter. Me, I go check that out, I'm a one out for myself. I'm a personally know. So Peter did not know Lepo Dan when Lepo come to Plymouth Avenue and look help from us. Yeah. So the court record show me why him go to prison. He rub and shot a man in a barbican. Yeah. And, and I saw him uh, yeah. in a power prison. Yeah. Anyway, because me not call nobody name still. Yeah. Anyway, when me look, me see the tree gone. I'm going to see Lepo. I'm going to say, jeez, I'm going to come over and come to pass. Look, I'm going to tell Peter, I'm going to trust the boy, I'm going to like the boy in the mouth. I'm going to tell Peter, no. I said, Peter, I do not trust Lepo. I don't like him. I'm going to warn the boy, I don't know how the situation of Peter. Honestly, I'm going to say, I don't trust him. I'm going to see the boy, I'm going to do, do something. Mm. And Peter said, Molly, man, I'm going to talk to him. I said, Peter, what do you mean I'm going to talk to him? Then boy, they will come kill me, Peter. Mm. And that, me, I tell him, I don't feel good about him. Every time he come near me, let me get goose beam to something in you know, my body that's wrong, cool. And I try to tell Peter, say, Peter, something wrong with it. You can hear it. I'm saying, candid. So, every time I talk to him, I say, Molly, I'm candid. He say, all right, sir, okay. He said, you know me, candid? Me, I watch my back, so you can't stay there. Mm. Anyway, I'm sticking up and say, belly it. Well, I'm going to go for the ground and belly it. So, well, I don't like what I'm saying, oh, belly it. And them start to say, we want all of the money in the house, all of the jewelry. And one of them now, take off the wool on the jewelry. So we start to ship off. Everybody start to take off them wool. Mm. Peter tell them, say, we don't have any money. Come out, we don't have any money, you know? Yeah. Believe it or not, you know? Because he needs to in the work, you know? Because Peter is sick, you know? Peter develop a bad culture from a long tour in so much yeah. years. Yeah. Right? Yeah. So Peter cut to her and say, take a rest and better himself. Can they sense him go? They got drop them on stage. Yeah. So they say, Molly, I'm going to take a rest, you know? Get my stomach sorted, sorted out. And then him have serious head pain too, from the brutality, from the police, him have beat him up, mash up the wall and head chop, where he never grow back. Mm. Right? Mm. So I'm head used to constantly pain him and his stomach, so his head and stomach pain. So I said, we lock the tour for a while. To start him out proper before him hit, hit back the road again. Mm. So we never have the money to write him, so we don't have the money. We can't take the wall of the goal, eh? And I think when they say as value, we'll take them, please. Because Bota, I the same day, Peter, I forgot. I want to loan Peter Barra, you know, and Peter said, go pick up the loan at the back of the day, you know. I want him to come on the evening, you know, right, his man, he, you know, so I said, guess you go pick up the loan. I'm going everything good, man. Monday morning, you, you deal with that. Mm-hmm. Good thing, him, him never did. Oh. Go feed. So, I tell him, so, when I'm in the morning, see, I touch it, I'll fly, that's a true, but we don't have no money, we just come back from foreign. We have to run, come back from foreign, we don't have no money, and foreign, mm-hmm. to survive up there. Mm-hmm. That's how we run, come back home. We say, we don't have no money, you know, I have, it's 300 US. Alright, hold on the Marlin, hold on the Marlin, hold on the Marlin, hold on the So, I'm going to go forward now to the house now. We're there in the house. We're there in the house a while ago, when you you flashback. Alright, alright, so I'll continue with the house now. Yeah, yeah, you said no. So, we're there now, and them said, we'll go on the bed and we'll give them the wall of jewelry and everything, and let them start coaching me and say, yes, and you may pick a touch no one, give you no money, and you do this, and you do that. Yeah, but you see, as them enter, I just know someone tall you would. Just look on Peter and say, you know, don't say nothing tonight, because you are dead, and you will come for kill tonight. So you do everybody whoop me out, because you're not alive. Well, that's what you said to Peter. Yes, as him come in, mm. say, you don't say nothing, and you will come for kill. So you do ever whoop me your mouth. But now I forget get them words right about her. Mm. All if my lips say 100 years old, but I forget them words mm. Yeah, man, so Peter not say nothing still. Anyway, we belly to give them everything. In course, and in course, man, in course, and in galang and galang. We say, all right. But I'm actually talking about it. We say, but love, all. every time you come here, you get money, get everything. You know, we don't have any money. Oh, you don't talk to Lebo, just... though. You talk to him now. Yes. Mm. I try to talk to him to say, oh, my God, sort out the whole situation for them to kill Peter. Mm. Because them come, them say, Peter got dead. So I say, no, man, I have to sort out that thing now. Uh, five rasta man, I'm in the mouth, you know. Motor and me say not one of them try to start out the thing to you know he would try to talk to the youth and five of them know lepo you know the whole we know him you know mm-hmm. nobody now say one word I mean one of you take the whole event but then still no business with that them come to kill Peter cause that them get paid for Peter killing was a hit job and an robbery and nobody can tell me on earth that them you they just come to my house come rob away. No, it's big and rub away. Big, 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 a big seat now, Muta. Mm. Oh, that me have to tell you. Mm-hmm. Anyway, them search of the house. The home is one of them come back with Peter Billy. Cause Peter no sleep with a sharp billy on them. 
بدنا قال باري كومين باني ينور سي ده هيدا قال هيدا ويه ان تتا بيلي ان ان كوم راون ويدا بيلي ان يو بوبا بيتا هيدا ويدا بيلي موتا ان سي يو اغن شاب اف يا ايت سنا ايت يو سبا مي سيدي يو غسا وبا بيتا ايفا شاب اف بيتا ايت اه بكو دا 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 جوب اب اتشاك يبا افا بيتا ايت نا Hey. No, my key aunt of a man here. She got me a look at the boots. We're the way 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 the Yeah, but yeah. um, yeah, the billion is shape different. Yeah, it have a hook at the bottom. Yes, it have a hook. Yes. It have a hook at the bottom. But what may I say? Him stand up, and when you see, say him have a chap, Peter. You yes. jump up off of the ground and push mm-hmm. your brother with the machine time, and you push him. Yeah. Yes, I'm choking him off of Peter here. I'm saying, no, man, you can't have a woman here. No, sir. So I'm choking him off of Peter. Rush me now. Take him gone and buck me down my face, kick me up, kick me down my ground, and shot me down my head. Yeah. Shot me down my head now, so I'm laying on like my dead. Yeah. Because I blood no one thing, you know? Yeah. And I say, you know something, Marlene? Five strong raster man in your house, and not one of them lift up them hands for start or nothing. Lie down like you're dead. Yeah. So you just lie down like you're dead? Because nobody not start out nothing. So when you lie down like you're dead now, a pure gunshot start fire this one. A pure gunshot start fire, man. Don't get a boop, 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 boop. Them shoot up the furniture, shoot up the... I saw the man, them are going crazy like some coke head. Mm. Shoot up the whole place. Shoot way up, shoot up the whole several people, not the house. Mota, go on and tell them. So wait, when, when you get the shot now, your head, you, you, you didn't feel the pain same time, or you don't... No. You know the only thing we feel, Muta, mm. like you know when like you would I get electric shock. Yeah, yeah. But I feel something shock me. Yeah. In my head. Yeah. No pain at all. Just a shock yeah. feeling. The only thing the only thing when I know when I get shot. Yeah. Come I start with a whoop of blood in my face and my eye and my can't see. Yeah. But the house is dark, you know. Yeah. So then she said, I'm not dead. Uh, when I tell Muta, I start to roll my boat, come in a trimble, and I say, Rati, I'm not going to feel like I'm in my life. You know? yeah. I say, Muta, roll my boat to stop my body from trimble, to so calm down my body. Yeah. yeah. Then that one I tell me, I feel like I'm dead, though, the way I stop my breath. Yeah, I say, yeah, yeah, breathing yeah, again. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I stop it again and keep my body real calm, you know? So all them leave, all them leave. Like, all yeah. right, after them shoot you up now, then just leave. They must walk back downstairs mm. and leave. When they leave now, me, 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 wait, like, you know, me, not just like, say, just jump up, sir. Mm. Me, wait, like, uh, come, uh, wait, come, I say, they must come in a vehicle. Wait, Marlene, until you hear, like, something drive off before you get up. So, me, wait, until you hear, like, something drive off. When me, hear the vehicle drive off, and I'm, jump up, jump up and turn on the light fast. Mm. But before I jump up, me, hear, me, me, a I say, Marlene, Marlene, someone said, we enjoy your life. Them shot I mean, enjoy your life. Them I'm never going to answer them. We just want to keep quiet. And she, I don't want to feel my dead too. Because I don't want to just shut them out. Because I don't mm. you know if the man them in the house anywhere. Yeah, yeah. So I don't answer. So when we hear the vehicle move off now, I saw my answer. I said, Joy, yes, me alive. You're alive, Joy. Yes, I said, all right, jump up. Me and I jump up now. Turn on the light now. When I look, I said, Peter, lie down. Unconscious, but mm-hmm. alive, and he must sniff up the, um, the blood in his nose. Mm. Because she didn't belly it and, and start bleed from him head. Yeah. So, out of the blood, now he must sniff up something. So, Jesus. Um, so, them shot him in his head. He's himself in his own blood. Them shot him in his head. Yes, sir. Them shot him in his head. And, and, but everybody, them right? shot, and them shot, them shot, ma, them shot, um, Jai in our mouth. Yes. Jai, Jai, Jai shot in his mouth, in our foot. Yeah. Or, oh, so, uh, get in his head. Doc Brown, get it in my head. Peter, get it in my head. Mm. Michael, it green to Michael head. Um, Santa, get it in my side. Yeah. Anyway, when, uh, when we look now, my jaw, Peter now, but old Peter two foot now, and start drive out of the blood. Ah. Uh. <laughs> this is terrible. 
واو میگه تو اون تا بوده ایرویو همین was still breathing to that dead on the spot that dead on the spot yeah. knuckles on the spot man so anyway i said to myself said no marlene call myself you've got to look help for peter right now go to your neighbor so this thing come to me say take his numbers help beg anybody apart we run go to do now bleed furious we said to us when the man saw me i bleed the man speed up we said lord when we look now we said santa david's jeep so we said we had Come let me live every remember, say Santa, and I also know. We won't go to Santa, Mr. Santa, Santa, Peter alive. Help me know we can't see if Peter, you know, don't drive off and leave us. Help me try Peter go to hospital now. Santa say, you know, say, me not help when I come get shot, you know. I straight to hospital, me have a money. Me not help when I come get shot. That is the exact word that Santa used to us. Me say, ah, when I'm gonna drive off a jeep, now hang on for the jeep, so. So try to stop Santa and say, no, nah, stop. Anyway, me let go off of the jeep. Me rush go to my neighbors. I said, as I rush to my neighbor, my neighbor just run come out. I said, Marlene, what, man? I said, Lord, I'm shoot at the wall. I said, Peter, alive. come now, come now. We can't save him, Peter, come man, we can't save him. And my neighbor and his family, come, rush upstairs with me. And the two of them lift for Peter, you know. Rush down, put Peter in the car, put um, me sit down now, have Peter in my lap, I bleed furious, you know. We, we carry down Mikey now. Me and Joy, old Mikey, carry down Mikey downstairs, put Mikey in the car. Joy says, she'll steal free. I say, yes, steal free because I'm going to call help. I show to my next neighbor and say, call the police. No, people is alive still in the house. Call the police. We need help. Anyway, my neighbor said, call the call police and the police said, come. While me and Mikey and Peter are going to the hospital with my neighbors. The police them come now and carry Joy and Fry. Yeah. After us, I said, Mota, when we reached the hospital, I couldn't believe what took place. This part frightened me more than anything else. It's in a shock me in a do all of this now. Yeah. But I just know it's so evil. Come for in a shock city now, but I just know so I still have to keep a consciousness for deal with the whole situation. Yeah. So I went to the hospital now. I see one Indian doctor, he said he come from Guyana. I see him run, come over, but he don't know, say, I'm a big superstar, this or anything, you know. To so all me perceive it now, it's like, them things are real teeth, because we're dreadlocks, and then me a police carry a wee, 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 out of the door, so it's like them have it. To so all me see it, say, yes. a, a, a police shooter up there. Some criminal activity where they go out and get shot. Yes, but the, the way the doctor did Peter, you know, so the doctor come over to Peter, come here, and Peter let him on a stretcher, side by side, you know. So me, I see everything. Right? Mm. We see the doctor take him on, Mota. I know, said the doctor pushed the bullet right down in a Peter head till Peter stopped breathing. Me all across the doctor and I said, but doctor, how oh, you for, I take your finger, push down the bullet in the mad head, what did you do? That's true, yeah. right? I look for your kid, you kill off the man. The doctor fall me off and I'm for shut my mouth. But see, you can't tell me for shut my mouth, I kill you, kill off the man. Mm. I said, Mota, but, Tell me this time I see my mother come. I say, mommy, mommy, me just see doctor push on the bullet now, Peter, you don't kill Peter. My mother said, man, are you sure? I said, yes. He must stop. I said, the doctor used one finger first. And so the one finger couldn't work, mother. Mm. He take two finger and push on the bullet further, you know. But just a Peter turned purple. I know what I could do after the second needle and said, and a zip, zip, and a stitch up the head. And those walks are come over to me. I said, don't touch me. Move yourself. I'm mean, just here kill Peter. Don't so wait, wait, so the bullet never going at you. It just grazed you. The no, it going at my head. But you know, it travel on top of my skull and come back out. Yes, so I have two holes in my head right now, and the hole on my head tap dig up right now. You have two, two holes, holes in my head. Really, really. Two holes in my head. The hole, the, right the, now. the bullet go in at the top of my head. And no, they them seal up in now, mm. man. You know. Mm. But you can't see the two impression. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can't see the top hole where it's going on. And the, and I can't see the hole on the top of my head where it dig up. Yeah. And the next hole down at the bottom where it 
Yeah, yeah. Yes, I can show you whenever I see you. Yeah. If you don't believe me. No, I don't have me not believe you, but I mean, me not believe you. Where are you, mama? I don't believe you, mama. Now listen to me, never did it. I never did it. No, I'm going to hear All right. So, I want to finish telling the plot about the doctor now. Yeah. Which we never really reveal this to nobody. It's the first me I reveal this in public. Anyway, when the... When I'm telling my talk to my mommy, my mommy said, Marlene, calm down, man. You know, I said, right. I said, mommy, don't tell me. I said, mommy, I see what I see. You said, my uncle see two total that's come for Peter's dead body now. And I push it fast. So I said, oh, what, what am I trying to dead body go so fast? Like, something happens. So anyway, me come out of the bed now. I'm here go around the screen when me see them carry the dead body. Go around. Mm. Me I look now between the screen. Because the screen never walk my part and me can't look through. Because I can't walk and everything, you know. Mm. So I tell you, so when I look through the screen, I see the doctor push accident down Peter's mouth. And I see my big Peter's stomach. And I see the doctor lick him and I say, Lord, I walk on Peter and I say, Lord Jesus Christ, Lord Jesus Christ. So I say, yeah. it's what I go on. He come back, he pump Peter's stomach, he pump him, pump him, pump him. He yeah. roll in here again and I say, Lord Jesus Christ. So I say, but I don't understand it. So, oh, when I just carry Peter coming now. I cannot give the oxygen, not pumping stomach. Mm. No, I do not like that. It's after the man dead, sit up on the head, on the go back, see a dead body. No, I give really, oxygen, hold on, hold on, and hold on, pumping hold on, hold on, hold on. stomach. Alright, hold on. Oh, you know what's the dead? Oh, you know what's the dead? Because I see Peter turn purple, stop breathe. Yeah, but that don't mean the dead. And the doctor just the um, start stitch up back the head. No, but when I say that don't mean the dead. Double car you see him purple, that don't mean the dead. In the dead, in the dead. Me check him out myself. Me check him. Me get, I get up off the stretcher and I check him. Yeah. I go over to Peter and I feel him and check him. Dead, dead, dead. Me make sure I check him before them they come see him. Yeah. yeah. Me check him. I come out from the stretcher and I check him. And I'm dead. No more breathing, nothing. And after that, no, them I get excited. But all the excitement come in. The doctor never know it was the great Peter Tosh. Them just kill and when him find out, said the great Peter touch, you know, I saw him start bad for Lord Jesus Christ, you know, and start pump action, oh. you know. That me feel like me want to beat myself, you know. Right, but right, if right, me right. didn't know, say, me didn't have to establish the fact that this is a great Peter touch, probably Peter would be alive today. Right, but right, me right, never right, know, right, say, right, hold on, 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 that the doctor who come there feel say is a criminal, the police does shot. Yes. So him not take care of that criminal there. No. But when him, go find, when him go find out now, say, I agree with Peter Tash now. He might try to revive now back Peter Tash. Yes. That is what you say. All right. Yeah. Yes, it's me the same. Oh, me no, no. I mean, never understand all of this, you know. What was going on still, you know. You know, all me understand is when them admit me now, Joy, come look for me in the morning. God, mm -hmm. I never admit Joy now. Mm -hmm. And Joy said to me, say, Marlene, you know, so this, my foot hurt, man, the doctor, the same, the same Indian doctor say, um, the shot, not, you know, my foot are great to get green. And my foot are me with penis, Marlene. I come off of the hospital, but I'm saying, remember, feel the foot, Joy. I'm start feel her foot, when I see one hole. Take my finger and, and follow the hole, go right down to the ankle. When I reach the ankle now, I feel a lump. I say, Joy, see the shot right here in your foot, down as well. Tell the doctor, say, me, say, the shot in your foot right down to your ankle. And tell him, um, just when you go back to him, tell him, sir, tell him, say, Peter Touch, wife, say, for so telling him, say, me see, or I'm kill my husband last night. Yeah, and that no right. Joy, go to the man in the morning. Tell the man exactly what I'm saying. You know what the man say? Lady, let me tell you something. I come from Guyana. And Peter Touch is my idol in Guyana. I did not know it was the great Peter Tosh. And when I found out, oh, it was too late. I tried to do my utmost best to save him when I found out it was the great Peter Tosh. But I did not know. Mm. That's what Joy come back and tell me. So you tell me now, Mota. Mm. Hmm? And kill him, and kill him, I does. Yeah. Yeah. That's what Joy tell me now. I so know me put everything together now. Mm. And I say, okay. Yeah. In fees, was a criminal. In fees, I was a criminal. Mm. Worse than a foreign doctor didn't understand the, the situation. Yeah, 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 so true. when in charge, see if Peter knows, when he 
find out now it's says the great Peter Tosh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's why he might knock him head in the ball for Lord Jesus Christ. Yeah, and I couldn't right. understand how oh, a doctor beat him and I said, Lord Jesus Christ. Yeah. Something wrong. Yeah, he might, he might but the man just panic now. Yeah, he might panic. And kill him idol. Yeah, he might repeat. Yeah, man. All the doctors finish off Peter, man. Trust him, man. Yeah. I mean, I said, could I live forever, whatever, you know. Yeah. But at least, be my chance him. then. Yeah? Right. So, free eye. Some give him no chance. So, so talk All right. free eye. Yeah. Then, admit, free eye, free eye unconscious. Mm. Free eye died like three days after. Because mm. Peter, um, free eye was like in intensive care. Yeah. So, but, them said, them can't save him. The bullet large. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Yeah. His machine, a machine that keeps free alive. And them said, them have to pull the plug now because there's nothing more them can do. Yeah. Anyway, them pull the plug. Man joined. Was there at the time. When them pull the plug, you know? Yeah, yeah. Come go with her, I mean, she, you know? Yeah, yeah. yeah. All the vibes with her and all of that. All right. So, me could shift you now. Because, in all of this now, you did have to come now, come tell the youth them, say, this happened. What, what happened this or now? What transpired now with the youth them and... What the children name? Yeah, when you them, when, when well, you well, they know at the time the kids them wasn't at the house now. No, me know, me know, but I mean like, are you really have to go bust and use it to them? I mean, you have to go tell them now, say this. Yeah, happened. but I don't see any of the kids. When Peter passed out, none of them come to the house. Come even check me, ask no them father did or nothing. Nobody said anything mm -hmm. because some of them leave my house in bad blood, you know. Right. Things them do, yeah. and Peter dismissed them from the place, and things them do was nice. Yeah. Because even one of them has said, me make him father beat him. I hear that Andrew, the prime reader, said, me make him father beat him. I don't make Peter beat none of them children them. My mother and father never beat me, so oh, oh, I'm not going to make a man beat up in picking them. And then, um, Andrew was, was not a kid. Andrew, a big young man. Mm -hmm. I tell him, I'm just a couple of years older than Andrew. Is what Andrew did. Make him father beat him. Yeah, I yeah. had nothing to do with it. Yeah. And if Dave wished to speak the truth, Dave lived with us too. Peter, older son. And Dave said everything what went down. Why Andrew get beaten? Mm. Is what he did. Yeah. yeah. So we the Andrew, Andrew said on the radio that, that are you make him get beaten? Yeah. So me hear my talk, say me make him get beaten and Peter run him out of the house. Everybody will know me tell me that. Even mm. today somebody stopped me and tell me that. Yeah. I try to tell the people, I say, me not make Peter beat him, son. It's what Andrew do make him father beat him. All right. Me I have I, nothing to do with it. I will leave. I, I, all right. I you don't talk about the things. All right, let me ask you something. Because so what he did wasn't pretty. Yeah, we, no, we, no, we don't want to hear what he did, but you may ask. No, we don't talk about him, though. Yeah, but let me ask you a question now, you see? A whole heap of ones have it for say that your aggression keep a whole heap of ones from Peter, like, because you're so aggressive against people, against ones. And so that's a lie. So overprotective. That's a lie. You hear me, too? Let me tell you, you have some weird character used to come out of house with him terrible. Yeah. And going with some weird things, man. Yeah. So he said to me that one would talk out. Because yeah. me not used to certain things. Yeah. And certain things we see I got and said them something then alright. Mm. Right? Mm. Even Peter see it for himself too. Mm. So wish I was sure. I say, is Peter make me talk you know? When me I go to school, I don't talk you know? Mm. My teacher then used to send for my mother. I said, why this Young day you don't talk. My mother says, that's what you say from baby, you know? Mm -hmm. She do not talk. You know, so Peter make me talk and talk up for my rights. Yeah, yeah. So, you know, you know, no aggression. I'm going to start the truth. I'm going to put a stop to certain things that was not right. Yeah. And yeah. them don't like that. Yeah, yeah. They're not expected us. Come in my house, do as them like with me, and do as them like in my place. Yeah. So you reach a point now where you have to tell them, say, you don't have no money and you don't have no money. Yeah. yeah, and, and you know, so before I go back into the story, you asked me something earlier on. I'm going to skip it and never answer. You asked me about the business aspect. Never go back to the killing, you know. But I just want to clear up something. Yeah. It, about, it asked me about the work for, or my work for Peter and thing. Yeah. Hold on. It's me, Mr. B. From me 14 year old, me I work on the North Coast as a dancer. I dance and send myself to school from me 14. I come in 2 o'clock every morning. By 6.30, my mother wake me up to go to school, right? Yeah. And we send myself to school for six years. I send me here, I send myself for four years, go to accounts, mm. come out, I get a job working at a credit union, where I did accounts type and silence for the company. Peter looked at me and said, Marlene, I want you to stop working for the company and come work for me. And me, I work, and me, you for work for man. And me, you for come make, make some money. Because I'm running around in my kitty. 
to come use your brains for me. I'm saying, all right, Papa, no do that, man. I'm going to leave the job, and I'm going to stop dancing upon the North Coast. Because I don't want you to dance upon the North Coast. I'm going to still dance upon the North Coast, even although I work at, um, as an accountant, still, you know. Yeah, yeah I'm going to love dancing. Dancing was my life. So, in take my time two jobs, as a dancer and as an accountant. All right, start to work for Peter. I'm work. First, I start to work for him as in secretary. I do all him books, I do him like a type in, and the way I want him letters them go out. But I send out him letters, type it up nice and pretty, and send it out for him, mm-hmm. and get him response and all of that, you know? Yeah, yeah. And read my man and say, whoa, because I can't cook again. I'm saying, no, man, that day just was like So, boot up. We start to work for them, my man. I just, when we start, Check him in books, them. Yeah. He said, Peter, bring, bring your books, them. Come give me, man. Let me cut you them for you. I'm going to start cut you in books, them, man, and check on, check on. You know, I said, Peter, you know, I see your books, them, not too right. Then I write, man. So I'm sitting over where me see, cut down. Yeah. So much money, Peter. And every time you go on tour, yeah, yeah, and when yeah. you come on, my mother say, Marlene, you know, I say, me not make the money. Yeah. So I said, Peter, you left me for so much months every year. And nine months out of the year, Peter left me, you know. He made the pan tour for like three months. Then him come home for one month, gone again for the next three months. Yeah. So out of the year, mom was seeing like for four months. And I said, Peter, you gone every time I tell you, you come on, you just come home, sit to me. Mm. Peter, Peter, not Peter, but I'm bad for me, you know. Yeah. No money, Mr. Bible. He said, and when we start checking books, I'm really, she say the things are proper. Yeah. So, so I start going so deep. Yeah, so I say, all right. No. I said to myself, say, Peter, you have to step up on this now. You know? Step up on it now, start sort out the thing. I mean, you get Peter, that's one of the best record deal he has ever seen in him whole complete life. Mm. And when the man get the money, man, the man said, lady, no, man, I'm going to pay for the house for you, man. Okay. I work with me for yeah. buy the house. Yeah. And I like to pay just buy the house, you know. I put money in him pocket to buy the house. Yeah. Yeah, I tell you. Like... Because even the contract with him on the man, I bust up that man. I go to court in New York and stand up in front of the highest judge in New York City. And I me defend Peter in the courthouse. I'm telling him, I'm a 24-year-old. I said, I don't chat to the judge. Mm. I said, we'll get what we want. Then double him advance, then give him more royalty rate. And the judge invite me and Peter up in them chambers, listen to the old complete new clear war album from top to bottom, yeah. and say, This is great work. This is great. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah. all right. So, you did, you did, you, did, you, did, you did contribute to, where I say that, you contribute to the world vibes. Yes, uh, yeah, not just as a woman, a little pretty young girl. But as a contribute, but work up with my name pocket too. Yeah. Me tell people, say, no, and uh, Peter helped me, you know, because I'm the odd man, you know. Because mm. I'm a dancer, an excellent dancer, and I'm an accountant. Yeah. And me work for Peter is me, El Peter Tosh. Yeah. But with, within the helping of Peter Tosh, it helped me too, you understand? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I learned a lot. One on one. Being with the other, Peter Tosh yeah. was being in a university. Yeah. He, he was like my professor. <laughs> that yeah. always to teach me something new every day. Yeah, yeah. And I mean, I love that. Yeah. And Peter was a historian, and I love it. He must have told me about my history, especially my African history. And I love it, love it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. and I love when it was for. And my sister Peter was for him, you know, a cause. And I love the cause, you know. And I say, what? Well, because me, I go to school, and me, you know, know one thing about apartheid. No, they never teach me that in school. I never even know some of people living in a slavery in South Africa. Mm. So Peter made me know them something there. And I said, what, Peter? So I said, all right, the first song I listen to is a song named Fight Apartheid. Yeah, yeah. And I asked Peter, say, Peter, what do you mean by Fight Apartheid? So Peter said, Molly, you don't know? I said, no, I don't know. Come do it. Peter from 17, you know, I'm tell you, you know. Mm. Right? Yeah. So... We don't know enough things. Yeah. I'm young, you know? Yeah. So, and I just had experience. I mean, I said, that's a go on. And I said, yes, man, I'm going to fight for the I'm going to use the music, you know? I make them people that fight down there for them rights, you know? And I said, Peter, go ahead. I love it, beloved. I'm going to help you fight four people. I love it, Peter. So I saw me help him, you know? I stand with him, you know? All the rain with him, you know? Yeah. yeah. So our relationship wasn't just based on a love relationship. Yeah. The love was there, yeah. But me see something further. The cause. Yeah. I'm stand up and fight for that. Yeah. All right. Yeah. I mean, if you go to know, say, me contribute the way. Yeah. I feel happy. Say, me help 
Peter for shut the people in South Africa for free up themselves. Because when we did the show next door South Africa in Swaziland, we yeah. said, Mota, the people them carry Peter upon them shoulder right round one big stadium, mm. the African them. Yeah. I couldn't believe my eyes. Yeah. Thousands of Africans. And you know, say, Ah, for the South Africans, them in a way, a few years past, come over. The people them out of gate here and come in and on Muta. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Which yeah. never pat myself on the shoulder for this. Because when we go to the gate now, I say, Copeland, for the gate. I say, ah, for the Africans, them out there. I say, Copeland. But this is right, you know. Me start talking to the people them, to, to the, 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 the friends, I say. People, why so much I want to out here and can't come in? Them say, lady, the price of them a charge to come in, and over uh, two weeks pay that. Mm. In South Africa, we don't have the money, and we are come to hear the message. And I say, hold on there, I say, Copeland, the gate of a fly. Copeland say, Marlene, but I can't fly the gate, Marlene, I can't do it. And I say, all right, Copeland, when me I go backstage, I'm going to call Peter, and I make Peter know if they are for the Africans, I'm outside. Mm. I say, I'm go to Peter now, after the show now. Show court. Intermission, Peter the back. I'm say Peter, half of Africa and them outside. We got to let in these people, Peter, do not finish the show unless these Africans come in. Peter says search in the marine. But Larry come tell me no marine because two in back states, even no walk one. Yeah, you see? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So Peter said, Alright, Marley, I'm not finish the show unless the gate fly. Come back at the gate. I make sure the couple and father fly the gate. I'm say, Alright, I'm gonna go back at the gate. Peter go back one stage and say, Oh hey. If I don't want it, next segment of the show, fly the gate, I'm not finish the show. So, Peter said, fly the gate, no, fly it up. Anyway, Copeland Falls bust the gate, no, I'm half a bust the gate. And the next um, man would have did it as the gate man, too, which then was with the promoters and everything. Yeah. So, then bust the gate, no, I me say, motor, when they bust the gate, but I have to hide. Stampede, <laughs> me shake. If you ever see all the Africans, they were real shield, me after the man. <laughs> me shake, Buddha. Me say, me have to hide behind the gate. So, how the Buddha step up me and crush me? Me go to some like that. Another radio fool, no one Africans. The master has shown me them past. Now, me get the opportunity to even hold the past. I'm and I look for it. I'm gonna say this one really have to work with. I don't own a country. And the people them say, yes, lady, this rough for work with. I will come and ask. Some of them say, we'll knock back over here now. I'm gone, we're gone. Yeah, <laughs> we're yeah. not going home. Yeah. yeah, man. And my tell you, the show was beautiful, Mota. Yeah. Me said, tears. Yeah. You cry. Yeah, man. Definitely. <laughs> yeah, man. All for right. real. And the people them tell me, say, Peter Music, them listen to. And fight for them right down there. Well, when we go down there, when we go to Zimbabwe and them place, Peter Tash is highly recognized. By the songs them that him sing when the struggle was really heavy, you know what I mean? Yes, yeah, sir. He more than most artists was known. Yes, sir. Them, I don't mean? think they ever love him too. Yeah, yeah. You know, to say the good is uh, music to people. Yeah, yeah my computer does it couple like a, a good herbal tonic. <laughs> yeah, 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 man. Really, right. man. Hello, yeah. All right, let me ask you a question now. Peter Tash, you lose the house, Peter Tash gone. Now we hear about him estate and thing. Oh, you coming at this now? Oh, you what part you have in it? All right, me now have no partner in estate in because look, Peter passed have twenty four years now, and I've never seen a dollar off of Peter Tosh estate. I've never given one cent yet. When Peter passed off, the, at the time them say, "Come on, law wife, don't have any entitlement." Yeah. It's after Peter incident them run go past the law for come on, law wife, you know. Yeah. Because I got no papers on Peter, you know, because I tell you, we did a native wedding. Yeah, you know, Peter does do not believe in Babylon wedding. Yeah. And everybody know that. Yeah. You know, it's an industry so in culture. So them, say, so them say two years of common law, no, you don't have yeah. no rights. We don't have no rights to the estate. Yeah, yeah. So, for me nine years of service with Peter, when me butter butter with that man, help build him. Government ever tell me, say, Lord, did they say, me not entitled to a dollar, I'm a man estate. And them change Which is know. really unfair. Yeah. Because everybody who know a colleague of a Peter is sitting you know, on, never lay a hand up to help Peter touch, you know, and me with butter butter with the man for nine years. You ever tell me, you never tell me, say, la, me, me not get a dollar off a of Peter estate 24 years now. Yeah. And then again, them stupid, so I try to skip out of this, you know, and me, you know, with the whole of Peter money, they were all over the place, you know, because me, I'm a contact, you know, 
a medium books I mean, you know, if a 15 publishing company, if a five record company, I mean, you know every one of them. Yeah. And none of them See? come back, no, nobody no come to you, come talk, you ask you no know, question about nothing. Nothing. I one of the time I broke up deals. I did one come, I said something to me, and the only thing they said to me is because I'm on the M16 guitar. Because what I did, you know, when them see me now, people send me the auction, the M16 guitar. Me now, I'm from Peter Guitar and sell that, you know. I use Peter Touch M16 guitar as my weapon to bring Peter image forward in the light. Because yeah. them, they overshadow Peter image. Mm. So when me do that now, me jump up everybody now. Me jump up everybody now, you know. Yeah. So them start look forward you now upon Peter image and everything, you know. And I saw now the son them and the children, some of them try to contact me and find me. Right. When them say, say, me say, I'm going to auction the guitar, which I had, we have no intention. Right now, one of them approach me and said, they want the guitar to give this new man, most of the manager, Corey, or whatever his name, mm. figure sell it in America to an Hall of Fame museum. Right. He said, me not do that. So who have the guitar? Me, who have the guitar? Me have it, Muta. I have the guitar in my possession for 30 years. Okay. Yes, and I still have it. Chris. And not only the guitar is them to have other price possessions of Peter. And me are all them because right now me want to set up the Peter Tosh Museum. Me think Peter Tosh yeah, is yeah, a yeah, museum. You tell me that. I use you tell me that. Yes, yeah, so I'm right. working on it. All right. Me what me I do, I'm trying to put all of what I have for Peter to all set right. up that museum, all you right. know? I'm not going to mean, get no help or no support. I mean, one butter butter right through. Yeah, I mean, my, my man did. I end up with, used to work for the man out of job motor. Mm. End up with shot in my head in a shock. If it wasn't my family motor, I tell you, sir. I don't know if I'm not going to talk to you to conscious. And my people them fly down from foreign. I will be. I said, hey, 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 hey. you ain't going. Yeah. Come on, my sister, the mama, my father, stand up with me, you know. And shot me out properly, you know. Drop about a foot of the drive out of the shock, you know? Yeah. Cause when me then I had all me know if I say yes, no. My mother gave me food, I said no food, mommy. I'm not sleeping, me not eat and sleep. And my mother for food me dread to be eat. And my two sisters them fly down and lie down one pound one side and one pound the next and I say, sleep. You're not getting up off of the bed. You're going to sleep. And I saw me start sleep. Alright, And then watch me take care of me. Tell up some come back home. Them chip out of Jamaica and fly out. All right, Marley, yes. I want to go back to the guitar, you see? Because mm -hmm. for, a program, <laughs> for a program, where we did that do? We mm -hmm. did a program in a February. Mm -hmm. And we was told that is the bridge you know, a control pulse of the guitar. All right. Let me get this clear. I have the guitar. I am setting up the Peter Touch Museum. Um, I approached King to and King to say he's interested because he did the last show with Peter. Yeah. So, I am setting up the museum and with Kingsley Cooper. Mm. So, this is how Kingsley come into the play. Mm -hmm. Kingsley is sorting out a place for us to set up the museum in. Oh, long and it's long something long. I set up with not me alone going benefit. Me and all the children going by benefit. And the mother going benefit from it. And other people to go and benefit from it. Mm. But me say, me want to do something for Peter. Mm -hmm. Same on me, butter, butter with him. Me want and like Peter. In a my own way, mm -hmm. by sitting on the Peter Tosh Museum mm -hmm. and a Marlene doing that in Kingston. Because Kingston play a major role in Peter's life and his career. Mm -hmm. Yeah, me I said, me pro dance, good all over them do our country, you know. But me said, me, me want to set my town too. Yeah, yeah. for Peter. Yeah. And me know if me wrong to do that, you know. All right, no, you're not wrong. But so when the time come, when the time come, you, you have access to the guitar. Yes, man. Uh, my stuff are in storage, and not only guitar, a lot of stuff are stored. No, I know, but I talk about the guitar, because the guitar was in question, that you never yes. have the guitar. Them say you don't have the guitar. You don't have responsible for the guitar again. Them say you're not responsible for that guitar there again. So, so who is responsible for it? The person who you just mentioned. No, man. No. Kingsley Cooper cannot own the guitar. Oh, Kingsley Cooper to own the guitar. Me no know. That me ask so you. So, never just give to Kingsley Cooper, sir? No. No, no, no. 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 Me no know. That me ask you because it was an nope. action one at a time. And then the, them, the them, guitar, them, yeah. my access to it whenever I want it, mm. 
I just tour the guitar with other stuff I have for Peter for the museum. Because okay. we're going to set up a museum down at Tulsa. That's why certain things I have is with King Cooper because he's the one that is going to assist me in setting up the museum. Yeah. But King Cooper do not own the, the M16 guitar. Yeah. Yeah. And I'm not the old panic either. Yeah. Okay. So that's a stupid figure that my man Hard work, my hard work to yeah. underscore give it to King Cooper. Yeah, yeah, legacy. Crazy. Yeah. All right, all right. <laughs> no, no, no. All right, so where are they now? Where, where, where are you doing now? What, what? Well, at this present moment, Look, I'm not hear, working, you know. We hear all of them what, things that are going Eh? We hear all of them things are set up for Peter Donga, Westman Lana, and him son, them fly Donga, and this fly that, and everybody involved with this and that. And we don't hear nothing, your involvement at all. No one say you is the last person. Well, them you know? skip me out of everything, because they not invite me and know it. Because I even come on the program and say, oh, we hope to see Marlene Donga, whatever. No. Yeah, well, remember, say, me did I look for you, though, know? me did I look for you, though. Know? Because the evil the show we're going, me not get no invitation, nobody didn't invite me. To come mm -hmm. or nothing. Yeah, yeah. 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 And they will say, Marlene, we we'll look forward. Maybe my lucky is a couple and even call my name at the end of the program. Mm -hmm. Trust me. And in a good light, too. Well, so a long time. Call, well, me a call your name a long time. You know that. You know, it's a long yes. time. Yes, and thanks name. to you, too. <laughs> yes, <laughs> yes. people bring, bring back my name, you know. Yeah, yeah, Listen, yeah. Listen, yeah, but yeah. them ex-mail to everything, you know, mm -hmm. you tell you. It's like, me not, you know, involved again. Yeah. Because yeah. last year, I'm not entitlement, and it's like me, it's nobody. And are you and get like the shot? You know. And are you like get the shot in the head? And are you get the shot in the head? And me get the shot motor. And me suffer motor. Yeah. With shot in my head motor. Sometimes I don't remember straight. Yeah. Yep. And it them never do nothing you? yet. It's all right, sweet. Everybody, I call it Peter Tosh, bunny. It and me, you know, the shot still affect you? Mash up for Peter Tosh. The shot yeah. still affect you? I mean, it still affect you in your head? I mean, physically? Yes. Physically affect yeah, you? Yeah, it, it don't really hurt me now. But mm. it, it, I, I think it messed with my memory at times. Okay. Yeah. 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 But I remember 100%, you know? Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. oh, I should remember. Yeah. But you're not getting no medication for it, though, for that. Mm? That it, it don't go. You're not getting no medication for physical medication. For no, no, it, no. no. It don't leave and then, you know, the, her, the herbal world, you know? Okay. Yeah, so yeah, really you tell me that. You tell me that. Yeah, yeah, but I'm more turned to alternative medicine, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm going to leave with the alternative part of it. I'm going to go to the healing fountain in St. Thomas. Yeah, and beat the head but, under the, the water. Yeah, and it helped me a lot, you know? Yeah, yeah. So I'm not feeling any pain or anything. Yeah. Yeah, the only pain I feel is from the whole situation. What took yeah. place and the way they might deal with me. Psychological, yeah. yeah. Yes, yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, so, so... <laughs> But, but my healthy. All right. <laughs> I'm a still can't laugh. Come tell my sister, I said, I'll never laugh again. I'm happy. But that killed Peter. She said, No, Marlene, you're going to laugh again. And you're going to be happy again. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, man. Right. <laughs> so, I work on my book, my life story. Yeah. Come on, my book turn into a movie. Come on, my very triggered story. Well, <laughs> and well, then I'm, I'm working on the Peter Touch recipe book. Yeah, uh, but, Peter well, used to teach me a lot of. Recipe, yeah, how to prepare this, health food yeah. and all of that. Yeah. So I want to do a recipe book, a Peter Tosh recipe book. Yeah. Mm hmm And yeah. teach me a lot. teach me all about the herbal world. Yeah. You know? Yeah. And it made me even use herbal medicine and cure people. Yeah. I help a lot of people. May help children with asthma. Come and know the herbs we can use. Me have a friend who used to carry me because son every minute. Me say, Papa. Would you buy some bush and give the little boy for drink in the Mali but I do anything just to stop carrying this boy to the hospital? I'ma tell him the bush to go look the comfort relief. Mm. I'ma say that's boy the comfort relief and that's a little pan him. Breakfast. And what am I going to tell? And I tell you, mm. that little youth a big man now. Yeah, and yeah. no more asthma. Yeah. And it's more than one youth. We use a remedy pan and him good. Yeah. yeah. And it's Peter teaching. Yeah, See? Well, the, the bush doctor. The bush doctor and teach me <laughs> enough herbs, enough things. And then when we develop for myself and teach myself yeah, to. Yeah, you yeah, see? Yeah. Mm hmm Well, Marlene, the whole world here, you know, a while ago, you know, the whole world. Listen to you. You're kidding. Yeah, the I'm going to call my sister in my phone and tell him to listen to me. <laughs> no, man. <laughs> Yeah, that, the that, most that, 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 that,
All right, Marlene. Give thanks. Yeah, man. Give thanks to the Me have so much fun and love me. You see that me can't call no name yeah, too much. Yeah, yeah. So if you start calling name, the place down. <laughs> yeah, true. Because I say, I'm digging up, man. I love her now. Because yeah. I support me and defend me, you know? Yeah, man. Yeah, man. And it's a shame that them keep this big thing in West Milan and never even as much as send an invitation to Marlene. Mm. Trust me. Yeah, and me, everybody says so. Me feel so that so don't look good, Marlene. Yeah. You let it go? I would. Mm. Definitely. Why not? Mm. Mm -hmm. Then you call me and look for you if you do an interview and I can't find you. I don't even know if I'm going to go and watch my box still now. No, when I say... I'm not trust you. Listen to me after that. Yeah, but listen to me now. How oh, me I oh, try to look for you how long now I can't find you? What? And I hear your ears and I look for you. Yeah, because you see me now? Mm. I don't want to be no easy targets to nobody. Yeah. You see me and say, Muta? Mm. So I'm going to watch myself right now, yeah? Yeah. Yeah. So, I try to make myself not so easy for people can reach. Yeah. So, I just got make you really don't see me or hear anything from me. Yeah. But for watching my step, man, trust me, man, mm. even though I don't feel safe. Yeah. Really. Yeah. Feel safe, Muta. Enough things for me, you know. Yeah. Enough things I have, you know, for Peter, you know. Right? Yeah. I have things for Peter value millions of dollars. So, I feel watch myself too. Yeah, you definitely. See? Yeah. You know. Yeah. Uh, all right. I know you have him tape them though. Yeah, I have some tapes. And you know what? Most of, yeah. I know all some tapes go, go down now. Mm. We'll have a portion of tapes in our um, Peter Renter apartment in New York. Mm -hmm. I know so when Peter pass off, I mean, the apartment completes a furnace, tapes, a new album where I work on, mm. a big collection of Peter books. We say, Muta, we're in the hospital in Costa Gode. Buy me out of the apartment and teeth out everything. Mm. All my clothes, everything, my jewelry, my furniture, right. Peter Tate, the woman, take everything right, out so of my apartment. When, no when we go there, a police has come in my own apartment, you know. Yeah. Here, they put a black point and some enough going in there. Motor apartment, me living for six years. But everything when me have private motor. Yeah, yeah. Can't believe it. The people them thieves, my clothes up to my underwear, then thieves. All right, so let me ask you a question. If, 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 did have, if did have music, panty up, music, panty up, him never release. Yes, in the apartment in New York, when when comes to thieves, everything. Yeah. So, so and, and, and she even thief him company too. She go to court, go tell people, say, Peter Touch give her 100% of Intel Diplo. Oh, Peter forgive she Intel Diplo. Peter don't see this woman for four years for her team dead. Mm. And you got to tell me, say, Peter company, but run... In whole show, I have a sign of them company to film cousin. Uh, and we have proof because if them drop the papers, them, mm. they can't say Peter Touch own 100% of Intel Diplo. Mm. And she go a court up there, but tell judge that Peter give her 100% right to company. Mm. I don't know how she get over with something like that. Because right now, me can't find her from for so much years after she thief out everything out of my apartment, you know. Mm -hmm. Nobody can't find her now. Yeah. Dave them can't find her car. When we talk to Dave, Dave them can't find her. Me can't find her. Nobody can't find her. Mm -hmm. I said, she millions of dollars. I mean, I hear them and nobody talk about she. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, and she has the tapes too. The uh, unreleased tapes. All right, let me ask you a question. On a lighter side now. Tell me one of the moments them where you remember with you and Peter Tash without anybody around you, I think, where... I talk about the sex part now. I talk about the enjoyment we want to have. Where you can remember where indelibly in your mind. All right. When I used to come to River in the country, I said we used to have some wonderful time at River. Mm. Yeah, man. I said, warm me up, chew me up, drop me back into the river. I said, jump on my body. I said, jump on the back. I said, run with me, run, come back. Yeah, yeah man. And teach me to do self defense. Yeah. You should love them something there. Yeah. So, you ever try you ever <laughs> try ride the one wheel bicycle? Mother, give me some joke. You ever try ride the one wheel bicycle yet? Huh? You ever try ride the one wheel bicycle yet? No, I'm gonna take my two shot. My two shot. I try to go up on it, but I'm gonna go up on it. My two shot. <laughs> I wish I could. Yeah. What I wanted him to do was to teach me to play the piano. Okay. But I said, Molly, when I said, I'm teach you, me and you born the same birthday. And if me teach you to play the piano, no, man. I come better than me. <laughs> so I'm not teach you. Yeah, I yeah. you not have no more time for me again. Right. Like I just treat the music. All right, yeah, so I regret that. Not learning to play, play the piano. piano from him. All right, which one of the songs them you, you if if you had a choice in a song with I mean no I will leave still, but 
One song right. where does imprint. All right, my music. favorite song with Peter, the song that made me love Peter even before we meet him, mm. Creation. When I'm 16 year old, me discover this song. Because as a dancer, we always have like new songs to dance to, you know? Yeah. And I hear this song one day, man. I'm going to just get wild. I'm going to just couldn't believe it. Mm. Me think that song was the greatest song ever built. Yeah. yeah, creation. I'm telling my only 16. I love the song. I love the song. Yeah. We used to say, God, please let me meet this man. Jesus, I'm going to love meeting him. This man, great man. Yeah, for seeing that tune there. 16 year old, I pray for meeting him in a motor. Yeah. And I did meet the man when I say with him. Mother, I take the album and sleep with the album on my bed. <laughs> yeah, when I'm 16. Right beside me on my bed. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I think the album was the uh, boost of the album. Yeah, man, it's a play the right you know, there. And, and the strangest thing is a foreigner introduced me to the album, you know. Yeah, yeah. It's a, a yeah, Chinese lady from Thailand. It's when we used to dance, she used to come to the show. Yeah. And she come to the dressing room one night and say, she want to meet me, or to all the dancers then. So she want to meet me. Yeah. So I'm going to go out to where my sister, no, the lady where, the lady at the dance group, she come and say, Marlene, you know, so somebody put my pillow on my head straight back to Kingston. So I say, oh, somebody want to meet me. Anyway, I really got there too. I'm going to go out there. So I say, you know, I come here every Friday night at Malas Beach Island just to watch you dance. You can dance so well. Yeah. I like you out of everybody else. I say, yes. Yeah. And she'll tell me that she's a dancer from Thailand too. So she know good dancing. I say, okay. So she'll say, me and I came become friend. And she introduced me to her husband who was doing some, he, he does some factory here in Jamaica. Mm. That's why she is here in Jamaica. Anyway, them invite me to them house in Old Shade. And I say, all right. I ask my mother <coughs> if I can stay over. My mother said, all right. Because my mother said, you're a good, you're a good girl. You know? So she said, all right. Yeah. Anyway, I go to her house, my, them come pick me up on my lot to be tired, carry me down to them house. One day, you know, me and I were dance, you know, I will play different, different songs. Then when I look, I see this album, you know, with this man slumping a fire. I must say, wait, man, oh, the man looks so slumping a fire. I have to play the album, you know. Anyway, when I start playing, me and I did I listen to the album, man. I hear Christian start, I say, what? Yeah, but I'm going to play Chris uh, Motor one million times <laughs> today. And me and her stop dance. Yeah. We dance, we dance, we dance. Motor, when we look up here, in, yeah. it's a rain of start fast. Yeah. And it's, we say, come like what you want, wash away. Yeah. We're going to wait to reach back a town. Now, when I tell me to rain, do stop fast. I'm going well, to reach back a town to carry the album now, but introduce to my big sister. Yeah. That yeah. it's too good for dancing now. My sister has a dance group too, I'm dancing in her dance group too. So, me want to carry this album now to see. I'm going to listen to the album so we can create a dance from the album for her group. Motor is in a reach. As I reach the gate, so I start screaming for my sister. She won't come on and say, my name, what that mean? I say, listen to the album, yeah. listen to that truth, yeah. When she plays, she said, mm, Marlene, it's gone, it's gone. Yeah. We're dance, we're dance to this. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and also, Peter was a great dancer too. Peter used to dance to me now. Yeah. When we used to live at Eastman, Peter used to come from my van, uh, I put out some piece of dance in private me. dancer. It was your private dancer. <laughs> Mr. The man, great man. Mr. The man put on line, said, get up, man. Suppose you watch me and Peter dance. Yeah. Why, you know? It's two of us that dance. So, you know, my mother, back my right there, you know. Three step and all. <laughs> Woolly for three step and thing. Oh, man. And some funky. Suppose you watch Peter funky. <laughs> I really get down. Yeah. I mean, get down terrible. Yeah. I, I may not forget this music that we used to love, so I always used to play it when it called it, it's Soul Makusa. Yeah. Did you know that song? Man, da -da -na, da -da -na. Man, man of the bongo, man of the bongo. So, yeah. Man so of the when bongo. So when we played that to Peter, and yeah. Peter started putting some dance in some funky and things, yeah. I was like, no, Peter, you're better than me, man. I used to play all drugs, you know? I used to play all drugs, you know? I used to play all drugs, you know? Yeah. Yeah, man. We are it was the so fun at times, yeah. at yeah. times too, we have a fight with her, the yeah. feel of her, yeah. it was a perfect relationship. Yeah, we know, yeah, a big fight, auntie, but you know, so fight, man. Let, me, let me tell you something now, one thing where you said tonight, I were in my brains, I know, we're talking in my brains, and yes. it's that, the bread with the mash it over Peter Tash. And when, okay. it, when it look like, say, I'm going to chop him, you get up and push the brother with all them gun they pine pine you. Mm -hmm. And all them mash it, you know. You, you decide, say, you are going to push the after brother there because you're not making him chop your man. No, because you have a mother in front of me, mother. But if you have a mother, 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 you have a m
Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. No, man, if I live with a mad. Yeah, yeah. Trust me, man, if them do that. Yeah, man, may I tell you, that is really something else. Trust me. No, Muta, and if you ask Joy, ask Michael, and ask Santa, the three of them survive with me, they can tell if it's lying telling. No, I mean, nobody now goes to say Yeah, but there's three guns that look long in there and chop them on off of my man's head. But I'm not going to beat it, Peter, chop off Peter's head. Yeah. I'm going to chop you at the party eight tonight, Peter. Yeah, man. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> Real. Right. Give thanks, you know, mama. What? Give thanks. You know, I'm going to get the strength from and the braveness. You know, yeah, it well, just I, come I, over there. I like them, the braveness come by you. Trust me. They just like come. Them. And I like to me do it. And it's, it's not like say I'm a real brave person, you know. Yeah, yeah. But it yeah. just happens. Yeah, man. I love you. I guess. You. I but them say we're not trouble. Pick the shots with you from me, though. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> Yeah, man. All right, mama. Give Real. thanks, you know. Give thanks for the interview. Give thanks for your you just know, your inside. Uh, you yes. <laughs> Mucho. Yes. It's a pleasure. Yeah. And thank you for the moment. I enjoy talking yeah. to the world. Yeah. And give thanks again. I'm big up Peter Tosh fans. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. I'm big up the whole world. <laughs> Turn up your radio load. Turn up your radio load. Huh? Turn up the radio load. Can I marry the loud? Yeah, turn it up loud. Oh, look at um hey, excuse me. Turn up the radio loud for me, please. Oh, somebody gonna turn up the radio for me, yeah? You can't hear where I play. Hmm? No, I was outside, you know. No, listen to the, listen, listen, to, the, hmm? listen to the phone. Oh thank you, Muta Lord. Don't let me cry. <laughs> Wow, thanks so much. Yeah. Yeah, man. I love Peter Toss. I mean, never stop loving him, you know? Yeah, give time. <laughs> I mean, I love him kids, too. I don't want him to feel love him. I love him mother. So, I mean, I want him to feel like, well, he's a little love them. I love them. <laughs> yeah, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a can't make you go yet. Let me ask you a question. <laughs> okay. All right. How much years now, Peter? That. 87 to how much years? Uh -huh. How much years? So 24 now? years. So you don't find the next man yet? No, you don't know. So I'm single for 24 years, Muta. I'm not married again or anything. I live by myself for 24 years. Men, when I say, I'm not doing it, I'll figure it out. <laughs> but, <laughs> but I live by myself for 24 years oh, now. Okay, all right. All right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, give thanks, give thanks. I'm gonna give thanks. I'm gonna know if I get married again because yeah. I am 50 this year and I don't know. If I don't do it already, I don't know. Do again. Yeah. <laughs> I love me still look nice and sexy still, you know. But I'm feeling weird. I love my love, me. Yeah. Mods, mods. <laughs> All right, mama, give thanks, oh. yeah? Give thanks. Okay, thank you again, Buddha. Yeah, yeah. Bless it. Yeah. All right. The informative information presented in this video is motivational and is positively aimed at inspiring, educating and entertaining the viewers with the cutting edge of critical reasoning. If you enjoy the contents on the Black Radar YouTube channel, please consider subscribing to show your support.